A Clay County foster mom pleaded not guilty today to a criminal charge connected with the death of her foster daughter. Halen Volpatti is accused of leaving one year old Nova in a bathtub unattended. Nova died from drowning. She's charged with neglect of a dependent resulting in death. And tonight we have learned the Department of Child Services is taking action to revoke her foster license. WRTV investigates Kara Kenny spoke with the toddler's biological parents about what they want to see happen. Nova Bryant was born premature at 32 weeks with health issues. But she was born with a gastrocesis where her intestines were out, but they fixed that up. Birth mother Selena says the Indiana Department of Child Services removed Nova from her care two months after she was born. And they said that I wasn't capable of taking care of her. <clears throat> and they said that I wasn't learning fast enough. Selena has disorders including ADD and ADHD, and Nova relied on a feeding tube. Selena says Halen Volpatty was Nova's third foster home. Prosecutors allege Volpatty left Nova unattended in a bathtub for an hour and a half with her two biological four-year-old boys. Nova spent weeks in the hospital and died on June 16th from drowning. I hope Nova gets justice the way she should. Because she deserves it. Do you think what would have happened if she had stayed with you? She would still be alive. Selena and Nova's father had been fighting to get Nova back. I tried my hardest to do everything that they wanted. They blame not just Volpatty. I want her to serve time. But also the child welfare system and DCS. They handled it horribly. They should have, you know, given me a chance, a chance to take care of her. Kara Kenny, WRTV. Well, Volpatti is due back in court on January 13th and her trial is scheduled for April 15th. WRTV reached out to her attorney for comment and we are still waiting to hear back. DCS says foster parents must complete an extensive vetting process prior to having a child placed with them.